Hey guys, I'm about to head to the airport. My hair probably doesn't look very crazy, but it feels really weird. I bought Velcro rollers, cause I'm just in the mood to mix up my look, try something new, but I don't know how to use them. So I just want like a nice fresh blowout look, I think is what I'm going for. I think I need to get some of the length off of these extensions. It's a bit long where it just feels weighted down. Should I do it? Should I not do it? I put a bunch of cookbooks on my sofa to hopefully get Frank to stay off of it. It's really frustrating because he fully knows he's not allowed on it. Like if I go to leave the house and he creeps in here and I forget something and I come back in, he like runs away or, well, he doesn't run. He gets really low and scared and is petrified of me because he knows I'm gonna yell. I'm like, first of all, dude, chill. I'm not that scary. Two, if you know it's wrong, stop doing it. <sighs> so frustrating. Here, is my airport fit. I almost fell over. Oh, yep, falling over. I just got this big green hoodie. I have posted on my Instagram a bunch of times because I've been wearing it every day and everyone's been asking about it. It is like uh, an urban hoodie that was at Nordstrom, which yeah, I don't understand either. Leggings from Fabletics, socks from Youth to the People, and then I am trying to find white sneakers that I like but it is so difficult to find vegan leather sneakers. Ugh. Do I just let the trend die and not try to have sneakers? I really wanted to get like Air Forces just to have like a simple clean sneaker look, but also like Nike make some vegan leather Air Forces. It's 2020, get with the program. I need to leave. I'll show you guys my uh, full fit with my jacket on too. Here it is, you can't even see it, you don't care. Let's get to the airport before we're late. Oh, I'm going to San Francisco. I didn't say where I was going, did I? I don't think I did. Um, oh, another thing we need to talk about, but we can do this later because I gotta go, is I'm having skin issues. I'm 28 years old and I can't figure it out. So I'm in this process of figuring it out. I'm trying to use things I'm used to using and I know don't break me out because what the frick is happening? I don't know if you guys can tell, but it's just like, my skin is congested. I can cover it up, but it's just like freaking bump city over here. Ugh. I'm frustrated. Bye, Frankie J. I love you. Bye, cutie. You're so sweet. Good morning, San Francisco. Um, it is so beautiful out today. I mean, hi. Hi, hi, it is so sinking pretty. Are you kidding me? Wow. Just wanna check in with you guys. I'm working and editing over here right now, but my view is just so nice. I had to share with you guys, literally. Taryn's apartment has just like windows everywhere and they're all really nice views. That is my morning check-in. I'll see you guys later. As you guys probably know, my birthday is March 11th, which is a month away. But Tara and I went downstairs to grab a drink and she's been kind of weird all day and I didn't know why. And we come inside because I don't think she's gonna be able to come down for my birthday. So we're celebrating early and she surprised me with two of our friends. So we walk in <laughs> and there's just these streamers. All under and balloons everywhere. And a birthday sign. <laughs> <laughs> Try to copyright that, you do. <laughs> they got a vegan cupcake, it's so good. And now we're gonna play Battle Shot. Hi, early birthday. Are you kidding me? I love you. I love you so much. Hi, my guy. Hi. <laughs> it's how you say what? It's how you say ass. Look, translated to it. Ass ow, and ow, ow. titty. <laughs> Dude, they're coming in hot. <laughs> <laughs> you won't make eye contact. Oh. <laughs> Hi, cutie. 
Oh, there we go. We're doing something a little wild today. <laughs> this is horrifying. Like, I don't know what oh my god, is. every bump! <laughs> I'm freezing. <laughs> There. I can put them down here, oh. <laughs> but it feels warm. I was like, why are mine down here? Oh <laughs> the car they told you not to worry about. <laughs> Hi guys. So, I am trying to do a thing for Valentine's Day. That thing being creating a sheet fort in my living room. Frankie, you got any ideas for me, bud? Got any ideas for me? No? Okay. Didn't think so. Look at your eye boogers. Ew. Tomorrow for actual Valentine's Day, it's also one of my best friend's birthdays. Kind of a bummer to have your birthday on Valentine's Day. So I'm spending a lot of the day with her and then me, Simone, and Taryn are doing Valentine's Day dinner. We're doing like a little, I don't know, a threesome date? That's, that sounds really weird. Anyways. <laughs> well, I'm gonna try to turn my living room into a sheet fort. Wish me luck. So we have the roof of the tent done. It actually looks pretty cool. I didn't plan the layout of this before I bought everything. And once I figured out how I wanted it to work, I need a lot more sheets than I anticipated. I am so bummed I don't have enough sheets right now because this is working so freaking well. I am so bad at like planning ahead for things. I just like to do it and figure it out as I go. So the fact that this is working at all, I'm shocked by. It looks super legit. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, so I called in for reinforcements. I went on Amazon Prime now to try to see if I could get more sheets delivered, and I couldn't. Luckily, my friend Mariah, who you guys know and love, found me sheets from Target, so she's getting me those, and she's gonna bring it over so we can deck this thing out. I am getting so excited. Now, the real mission is gonna be keeping little Frankie the heck out of this. He keeps coming, like I had to pull this back because he kept laying on the corner. He loves hanging on little things. Frankie, I'll bring your bed in too. Don't you worry, don't you worry. I am so tired, but I think we did it. It is so big, Jesus. Um, but here she is. I just put all these balloons on it so it didn't just look like this weird freaking white massive tent when you walk in. So <laughs> that's kind of janky, but whatever. Um, I put little rose petals out, cause duh. And then it's pretty much just this massive bed. I laid out my couch, like I took the cushion off and put it flat. And then I took off my mattress from my pullout couch in my office. This isn't really focusing. And put it on top. And then this is an air mattress. I have the table here. I'll put like snacks and stuff on when we hang out in here. <laughs> It is so funny, but having this massive bed in here is so unnecessary. I just wanted to fill it up. It It's too big to be cozy, so I was like, oh, I need the entire ground to be soft and comfy. Ah, we did it. Hopefully she likes it because, wow, that was a lot of work. Taryn, I hope you love it. Hi, Valentine. Hi, Valentine. Hi, cutie. Babe, this is so 
fucking cute. I just took the thing off and then I brought the mattress. <laughs> Amy, are you kidding? This is so cute. How'd you set this up? This is impressive, babe. Thanks. It's hooks. Oh my god. And then I cut the sheet. Okay, Chip and Joanne. <laughs>